Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a really simple, easy look. I'm only just going to be focusing on the lips, so the eyes are going to be neutral. Of course, I have my eyebrows on already, but I will be using some Fenty Beauty products. Um, these products aren't new, so, you know, it's not going to be like a review or anything. I've used them before in videos. Um, I'm going to be using the Fenty Beauty Primer, uh, the foundation, and the sponge. And then for lips... For lips, I want to try out the Stena Lip Paint in and Sensor. That's the red lipstick. So, um, yeah, I'm just going to jump right into it. So, first I'm going to start off with the primer. This is the Soft Matte Pro Filter Instant Retouch Primer. Um, of course, you guys already know what the packaging looks like because everyone has reviewed this. So, I'm just going to take... Um, I'm going to do three pumps. I know that's probably like a lot, but they're not three full pumps, so don't trip. So next, I'm going to go in with the Fenty Beauty uh, Pro Filter Soft Matte Long Wear Foundation, and this is in the color 300. And I'm going to be applying that with my Fenty uh, Blender. Apply a few pumps on the back of my hand. You see it's kind of like a watery consistency, um, but I've actually dealt with waterier foundations. Um, this foundation does oxidize a little bit, so we're going to see what this looks like. So I'm just going to blend this out. This does dry pretty quickly, so I should probably apply it with my sponge, but it's alright. A little light, but um, like I say, it does oxidize, so... We'll see what happens after this sits on my face for a little bit, if it gets darker. If not, um, I can always go and contour, which I'm going to do anyway, but um, I might have to get a different shade. Maybe like 320? We'll see. So I'm going to go in with my Tarte Shape Tape to conceal. And I can actually already see it getting darker. You guys already know like this whole little situation. I've been doing this in my last few videos, but I was mixing the Maybelline at 24 hour shit. The Maybelline 24 hour foundation. Is that what it's called? Super Stay 24 hour foundation with my NARS foundation. And um I've been using that as foundation and I actually really like how those two mix together. The colors really complement each other. The um, It just looks really good. It just looks really good. I'm going to go in with my normal contour situation which is e.l.f. The reason why I'm going in with the normal stuff is so that I can, since I know these stuff work, I just need to know if the foundation uh, really works for me because I know all these other products work really well together. So, you guys know I like the cream contour. So I'm gonna take this down the sides of my nose. I know this looks like a really big brush to be contouring my nose with, but we're just gonna we're gonna roll with it. And I might actually have to add a little bit more contour than normal so that my face is balanced out because in person it doesn't look that off. Like it looks in person. I don't know what it looks like on camera because I can't see. But in person, it actually looks like my color. But then again, you know. You know. My eyes be playing tricks on me. So, of course, I'm going to go in with my Fenty Beauty sponge to blend this out. Usually, I would use my Sonia Keshek uh, body sponge, but... For the sake of this video, I'm going to be using this sponge. I do like this sponge for under my eyes, though, um, because it has this flat part right here. So it's really good to just get up under there, especially when I'm setting with um, powder. I still have a little bit of concealer on my hand, so I'm just going to really apply that down the sides of my nose. Right up against that contour, so I can have something to blend it with. I'm 
I will say that on top of this foundation, um, these products are blending out really, really nicely together. So I really appreciate that because some foundations, if I try to do this like routine with it, it's just like mud streak, mud streak. It's just a disaster. So I really like how these colors are all blending together. It looks really good. Of course, to set my face down, I'm gonna go in with the usual. Eyes are blended out. And then, set that in there. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go in with my Coco Contour, um, chosen to perfection palette, and literally, look at that, super pan. I'm just gonna take that brown, whatever I can get out of there. This is just a regular like e.l.f. Uh, blending eye brush. Down with the excess, and I'm gonna run this under my lower lash line. Let me get a mirror. That, oh, I have a mirror in this palette. <laughs> run this under my lower lash line. And then what I'm actually gonna do is I'm gonna take my shade and light contour palette, and I'm going to take. I'm going to take this shade right here, which is the middle shade, and I'm just going to apply that into my crease. Um, I want to add a little bit of something onto my like the center of my lid before I put on falsies. So I'm going to take uh, Becca and Jaclyn Hill's Champagne Pop. It's broken, so i got to be like super duper careful. Um, and I'm going to just take my pinky. I'm like dusting off my pinky. Um, and then I'm just gonna add that. So now that I applied that, I'm gonna go in with mascara. And you guys know this has been my go-to mascara. This is the L'Oreal, so, uh, yes, L'Oreal Lash Paradise, the Voluminous Lash Paradise. Sorry, I can't really talk while I'm doing mascara, but today we found like a stray dog and then we had to like find the owner, but like it was a puppy, so like Chandler was playing with the puppy and then I thought he had an allergic reaction because his eyes swelled up and I was like, oh my gosh, I know you're not allergic to dogs, we've had dogs. Um, but I think she just had her, um, flea and tick. I think she just had her flea and tick um, like medication because he was uh, petting her and then he went to rub his eyes and that's when his eyes just like swelled up. They were like red. I was like, oh my gosh, what am I going to do? But everything was fine. They, I just rinsed his eyes out and then the um, swelling went down. So he's good. Okay, so now I'm just going to put on some false lashes. Um, I've been using the... The Okara Eyelash, they're 100% human hair, and they're the wispy version in the color black. I've been using that lately. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take a small brush. Um, this brush is from e.l.f. It's a concealer brush. It's really, really tiny. I like to use this for my inner corner highlight. And I'm literally just gonna take some of Champagne Pop and pop that into my inner corner. I'm also going to do the rest of the highlighting on my face, but what I want to do first is I want to spray a little bit of setting spray. This is the uh, Urban Decay All Nighter Spray. So my face can get a little drink of water because it was spilling a little dry. Um, and you guys know my good old faithful um, highlight brush. I'm so, I was so hurt when this... Uh, broke and the day that this broke I was actually getting ready to go take my driver's license picture because I changed my last name and it broke and I was just like who told you who, who told you that was okay I was literally using the mirror because I like to use this mirror because it's so small and compact but I can get really close to my face I was using this mirror to highlight my inner corner and I don't know what the heck happened, but it just like 
fell. And I was like, how dare you? So that's how I broke my highlight. Okay, so I have lip gloss on my lips right now and I'm actually wearing the um, Fenty Beauty Stena Lip Gloss, or is this Stena Lip Gloss? What's this called? Fenty Glow, the gloss bomb in Fenty Glow. Um, I'm actually wearing this on my lips, but I'm gonna take it off so that I can try out this red lipstick. This beauty right here, it's so freaking pretty. Like, Rihanna was killing it with the packaging for all of her stuff. It's just bomb. Like, I'm not understanding who told her to just be so amazing. Who, who told her to be amazing? Who? Um, this is like, look at the doe foot though. That's crazy. I've never seen a doe foot like that before. So it makes me a little nervous. I'm like, it's pointy though, kind of, so that I can use this to line my lips, which is what I'm going to do. I'm not going to use a liner. Pray for me. I hope this doesn't mess up. Let me get me a mirror. Because this mirror, you know, struggles with having long nails. So... Let's just, let's just go for it. I really hope you guys like this video. Um, like a quick little get to know me slash uh, trying makeup, trying to find my color, trying to figure it out, trying to get my life real quick at 11 o'clock at night you know because the baby sleep now um yeah i really hope you guys like this kind of video where i just chat a little bit about what's going on and also attempt to beat my face in the middle of the night and um yeah that's it i hope to see you guys in my next video um don't forget to like comment subscribe and share my videos and then turn on that little bell that little you know the itty bitty bell on the side of the line little little itty bitty bell on the side just so that you guys get notified every single time i upload and thank you again for watching i have to see you guys in my next video bye